shipping contributes overall about 2 to 3 percent currently of the overall man-made CO2 loading in the atmosphere. The single biggest challenge for decarbonizing the shipping industry is the lack of available options at scale right now. When we look over the horizon at things like hydrogen, ammonia, or green production alcohols, they have better potential to actually get us there in the end, but the shortcoming with those is they're not available today. They are over the horizon to use at scale. MSC is an absolute industry leader in biofuels. We are on a routine basis using up to 30% biofuel blends. And you look at the long-term real decarbonization options, hydrogen is one of very few that's emerged right now that could be viable. For decarbonization, particularly in this transitional period, partnerships are extraordinarily important. No one entity can get there on its own. There must be a massive injection of energy and capital into R&D efforts to bring both alternative fuels and alternative propulsion technologies to the marketplace for us to deploy and decarbonize in the longer term. I'm an optimist. I have to be an optimist. I believe this industry can decarbonize and it will decarbonize.